Aha, aha. I know you all love beautiful, sweet, and delicious things. Like when you see this delicious bread, trust me, I know you're going to love it. And I love it also, absolutely. So guys, today I will be showing you all how to make this amazing two-in-one combo bread. Two-in-one Volkswagen bread. <laughs> Let's dig it. So, the first thing you need to do is to measure out your flour. You measure out 500 grams of flour into your bowl. And then you add in your sugar, 70 grams of sugar. Add in 7 grams of salt. Then you go in with 5 grams of instant dry yeast. Okay, so you try to mix the yeast with the flour. Combine the yeast with the flour. Then again, you're going to measure out your water, 270 grams of water. To that, you're going to dissolve some milk powder, about 12 grams of milk powder into that, and one teaspoon of your flavor, of your bread flavor. Then you're going to mix it uh, with the dry ingredients. After you have combined it to an extent, you're adding your margarine, 25 grams of margarine, then you place this on a higher heat um, speed and then knead knead it is super soft, stretchy and elastic, okay? Make sure your dough attends the window pane. Yes, like I always tell you guys, if you are making your bread or making your donut, you need your dough to attend the window pane test, just as this, you can see. So guys, my dough was ready. And then I went ahead, cut the dough into two parts. So after cutting the dough into two parts, the next thing you have to do is to take one part and keep aside, then the other part to transfer into your mixer bowl, adding a drop of liquid browning, adding a drop of your chocolate flavor, adding some cocoa powder, unsweetened cocoa powder, guys, then adding some some golden syrup okay you combine all those together to get your chocolate dough just as you see in the video now the next thing to do is to roll out this dough yes so you take the plain dough and roll it out just as you see in the video also take the chocolate dough or the brown dough and also roll it out now, buddies, you're going to place the chocolate or the brown dough on top of the plain or the white dough, okay? Just this way. So once you are done placing it, make sure that the two edges meet, okay? Make sure that the two edges meet just this way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> then you're going to cut the dough into long stripes, just as you see me do one two three four just this way so once you are done cutting it this way you roll it up each part you roll it up just as you see in the video once you are done rolling this up make sure you've greased your loaf pan and make sure your oven is preheating already okay because you're going to preheat your oven at 200 degrees for 10 minutes transfer this dough into your pan and you kind of place it haphazardly just the way you like it making sure that the chocolate one is um showing and the white one just like this cover it and let it proof for up to two hours one hour 30 minutes or thereabouts okay make sure that it has proven so well then once it has proven pop this in your oven and bake at 180 degrees for up to 40 to 45 minutes or um, according to your oven temperature Brush the top of this bread with butter or margarine, whichever one you have. Let it cool down completely and you are ready to enjoy this amazing bread, guys. I hope you're going to try this recipe. See you!